it No gunshots, but they getting Hey, what is up, you guys? Welcome back to another video. This is the first episode of the Christmas special. Time to find out what we're doing. So, some of you may recognize this. Some of you may not. This is the Salem, South Dakota map. Um, we are in FS15. As you can see, it is covered in snow. That's right, we're going to be doing plowing. Um, I basically took all the textures from the Bjornholm Snow RS map and pasted them here. Uh, there's still some stuff that shows up green and I can't figure it out, but like here, this is actually not ground. Uh, this is part of this house object, if I remember correctly. But, um, yeah, so like I said, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, we're gonna be having some fun in the snow. Um, I'm hoping like when I've edited this video that I've added Christmas music in the background um, I'm not sure of that at this p moment but yeah so basically all the snow is for those of you that don't know how the snow works it is basically straw just textured white anyhow we got the Chevy Silverado 3500 here uh, dually and we're gonna head over to the farm <sighs> go figure get hooked on the, there's a rigid body on this truck that I still haven't gone and fixed but anyway we're gonna drive through the snow we're gonna go over to our other farm here where our equipment is stored and uh, we'll kind of take a look around so I hope everybody has a very Merry Christmas and uh, has a lot of fun uh, I'm recording this on Sunday, so this is a ways in advance, uh, as are all of the videos from this week, but anyhow, turn on into the farm here, we'll pull up beside the shop. So um, inside of our shop here, uh, here and here. Here in the little canopy thing, we got the snowblower for the JCB skid steer. We got the PJ 40 foot gooseneck. Got the John Deere 4455 uh, front wheel assist. The John Deere snowblower that I edited. Um, basically, just took a snowblower that I found and basically just textured the whole thing green. I do want to go back uh, um, and do some work on this and make it an actual. Like a nice snowblower and make the make everything like move and stuff. Make it a little cooler, a little nicer. Uh, here we got the JCB Powerboom 260 Eco from the JCB DLC. We got a Can-Am Apache uh, tracked out four-wheeler with camo. And then we got this little Kawasaki. It's the closest thing I could find to a dirt bike. I was trying to find like a snowmobile mod. Uh, but I couldn't find any, and I could have swore I had one at one time, but I guess not. So we're going to start off this video. We're just going to kind of go screw around in the four-wheeler here. Uh, we're just, you know, it's just kind of a fun episode, a little something different. Uh, a little something kind of, you know, goes with the time of year, really. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to go drive around and jump some ditches. Kind of cruise around in the snow before we get going. We'll kind of drive over to town or something. Boom. This is actually kind of fun. <laughs> oh boy. Um, we, I have some placeable Santa stuff over here. So you can see there goes the sleigh through the air. We'll just drive over to one here, and then uh, we'll see if we can fly up in the air and catch them. Oh, oh, oh. 
Uh, one of the main reasons that I'm recording these in advance. What the world? Does it have smoke that goes up? Oh, it does. What the world? That's funny. Um, one of the reasons that I'm, another reason I'm recording these in advance is because I like to post the pictures, you know, like closer to Christmas time, kind of. But, we're going 60 miles an hour? Holy smokes. So, uh, we have one more piece of equipment to look at, and that is over here. Sally's so here we have the county building and if we pull up here take a look inside we have a county plow truck uh, this truck is private uh, what else is private just this truck and the snow blade really and then obviously this edit of the map so um yeah uh, i think we'll pull the pull this guy in here and we'll start uh start off plowing with plowing the roads um this thing you can load it up with fertilizer and then it's textured as like you know salt or something so that's kind of a neat uh neat feature but uh, we'll go ahead and get that lifted up, get our lights on. Uh, we'll come back with the JCB skid steer later on. And um, we'll use that. So some of the roads, are they sit above the ground a little higher. So they unfortunately already are plowed, kind of. Uh, so to speak. But... That's okay, we're still going to plow what we can. And let's get our spreader turned on. Oh, we're getting off the road here now. Probably not the uh, most realistic way of doing this, but we're doing it anyways. Uh, let's see. Let's turn off the spreader once, see if we can go faster. Not really. We're going to just turn the lines off. So, this is as far as this truck is going to go for now. We'll just kind of work with the city for now. Work, uh, work on town. shouldn't miss anything. I've really never done much of this. Uh, and actually, I got, got the idea to do this. I was playing on... Um, 
uh, the Bjornholm Snow Edition map. Uh, just kind of looking for something different to do, and uh, then it, you know the idea popped into my head of you know it's Christmas season, so why not do something kind of Christmassy by you know plowing snow and whatnot, and just thought it'd be kind of a neat idea. <clears throat> something a little different, something kind of to go with the season, really. Ah, we're not going to get every bit. That kind of sucks. That's dumb that the snow is... That the snow is doing that. Actually, in reality, we could, um, we could push this snow into a row down the middle of the road and we could bail it even. We could, like, take the bales, uh, take the bales and make a different texture for them or whatever, make it white. It'd be kind of neat. Definitely be something different there. <laughs> going on here. Kinda wish I had a better plow. This thing seems to be not cooperating. Now I see why I don't really plow snow much. It's kind of a pain. So we'll just kind of get this main road cleared up, get it opened, and just that way we can drive on it. Definitely doesn't have to be perfect. I think it's good enough for now. For what we need it for. Okay, so let's run on down here. Let's kind of push some snow as we go, I guess. I don't know if I have... Wind rowers. No, I don't have that blade in here anymore. Hmm. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna park this truck. And I'm gonna look. I had a blade at one point. That would fit on like a payloader or something. And that worked a whole lot nicer. So we could use that too. And we can use this truck for different areas. So 
we'll save and close this. Okay, so we need to set a timer for 45 minutes. Because I'm going to do these videos about an hour long. I think. Yeah. Okay, so let's go to my downloads. And put in plow. Plowing pack unzip. Rotate plow. We'll try that. Plow plus truck. Um, I can't remember which one of these boss V plows was for that. Um, snow plow V1. Let's see. Let's type in boss once. Boss, box plow. Here we go. This is what I was really looking for. Um, okay, so now we need to figure out which one of these is for the pickup. I think it's V1. And then I think V2 is for, like, skid steers and stuff. Yeah. So we want V1. Uh, what's this truck look like? Probably not very good, huh? Oh, good, no. I don't want that thing. <laughs> uh, I saw there was some plow trucks in here, so we're going to put in plow again. See what kind of trucks we got. Uh, we got a high boy. I know the high boy is a nice truck. Uh, Chevy C10. Why not? Uh, Chevy truck. Let's check it out. That's enough. Uh, plow plus truck. Oh, that's the one we were looking at. So, Chevy 4x4. Let's check out the store image on that. See what it looks like. So, uh, similar to the high boy. Texture, store. Uh, I think I know which one this one is. Uh, maybe not. I don't know. We'll try these out, though, I guess. Or take a look at them. We'll extract them. Ford High Boy. Okay, not a bad looking truck, that's for sure. Let's turn that down to 10. It's actually the original High Boy, too. That truck's been edited quite a bit. The Ford High high boy uh, ah and this is the lifted version lifted and edited version okay I'm interested to see what this 2002 is uh, oh it's that thing I'm not a fan of that truck so we can delete all this stuff and we can put the rest of this in there and back in game we can go. No version. <sighs> Excuse me.
Alright, so, uh, these should be in windrowers, maybe, um, tethers, I don't know where all this stuff is at. Not in auger wagons, definitely not in forestry. Um, we should have some stuff here in trucks. Where are the plow trucks? Ah, it's probably in misc. Okay, so here's the bucket for that. And then we'll buy us a... We'll buy a New Holland loader. Nope, I want telehandlers. Okay, there's nothing in there. So, aha, here's the V plow. There's the boss block, boss box, not blocks. Um, where's the high boy trucks? They in tractors maybe? No, let's look in brands then. Chevy D E F Ford. Ford High Boy. Okay, I guess we get only got the one. And we need some more money. Alright, cool. So we got us a payloader now. Oofta! I had to sneeze there, sorry about that. Oofta, excuse me. And we tipped over our V plow. That's nice. See, and I think actually this thing you can move snow with too. Yeah, that's right. But we want the big, uh, big blade. Two passes with that down the road and we'd be all set. Boy, I'd hate to hook one of these things up in real life. I would never want to unhook it. That's for sure. So now, as you see, drop this down and we got a nice big swath that we take out. Okay, so now let's hop into this guy and see if we can't uh, can't hook this plow up. See, I think if like with some work to it, I think this truck would actually be pretty cool. Ah, come on, hook up. Try selling it then. Or maybe it only works with certain trucks. I can't remember how this thing works. I know, I just know that when it does work, it's pretty cool. Okay, so this truck is not going to hook up. Uh, jeez. I remember there was some special truck you had to have with it or something. Okay, so let's sell the high boy. I think it was the D250. Let's look here. D250. Flap it. Um, there wasn't a... Well, maybe we'll... Let's see. Let's see how bad this truck looks. It's an edit of the D250. Maybe it's not an actual four-door? I don't know. Oof. Yeah. We are not using that thing. Yikes.
Okay, we just won't use the, uh, we just won't use the V plow here. We got enough plows and stuff to get us through, so. So we'll go ahead and we will plow this road. Let's see if we can't, uh, get it cleared off a little better. Yeah, one swipe, that clears up the whole lane pretty much, so. That'll help. Okay, let's get this thing dropped down. There we go, now we're plowing. Still skipping a few spots here and there I see, but nothing too major. It's a lot better, that's for sure. Actually, we could even turn this one on too. We can run double plow. There we go. Now we're really moving some snow. Once we get the uh, highway clear here, we can uh, work on clearing out our farmyards. And after that, we can go back to town and do some more cleaning. And you now, it's this isn't meant to really be anything serious. It's just kind of meant to be, you know, kind of screw around, mess with some snow. That's with some different mods. Something fun. <clears throat> and I'm not going to continue to do this after Christmas or anything. Uh, this is just going to be a, you know, during these few days, you know, this, the day you're seeing this video, so Friday, you know, the Friday, Saturday, Sunday coming up to Christmas, that's the only time that I'll be doing these. Just get uh, this little spot cleaned up. go again I don't think this plow is all the way down is it no it's not that's why we're kind of missing some snow kind of wondering about that. It's like, why were we missing so much? Okay. Yeah, we're way off now, too. Oh, goodness. Kind of want to keep it so it's along the lane here. Just like this. Just so that way we can see the white line at least. Oh, it's too far down now, huh? Yep. And now we're good. I 
It's a long trek. <laughs> I think we'll go about to the airport and turn around and then go back Just kind of go to this turn off up here and we'll go just beyond it and then we'll kind of work on cleaning up around it. Okay, so then we will work on clearing this off. Okay, that looks pretty good. Got just a little spot here to clean up. I suppose we better get the uh, airport opened up too, in case there's any flights coming in. Which I guess you never know, there could be. Yeah, I'm definitely glad that I took damage mod out, otherwise this would be no fun because like I was doing donuts in a field one with the uh, the Chevy, you know, trying to just get it dirty, see what it was like when it was fully dirty and um, after like two times around it was fully damaged and it's like, oh, well that's no fun, it's like taking that out then. Let's plow an in and out on this place and plow a little bit uh, of the parking lot as well. I suppose I'm probably actually kind of going a little fast. A little too fast for it. I think we'll set our crews at 6. 17, 18, something like that. That should be good.
It would be cool if like this worked as the same as actual snow and like you could pile it and haul it and whatever. That'd be kind of cool. Would definitely be a lot cooler if it did that. Even more realistic. And we'll come back here with the uh, skid steer snow blower and kind of get in a little closer. And I suppose we actually could have put in the uh, version of the V plow that went with uh, like snow blower or with uh, um, tractors and stuff, and then we could have used that on the skid steer. But that's what we got the snow blower for. Set that way too far down. There we go. Now we're driving again and steering. I'm going too fast again. I'm clearing off the dirt. Don't need to be doing that. Think anybody drives on the dirt? If they do, then they're crazy. Wrong button. Want the print screen, print screen button, not the uh, F2 button. Auto save kicking in. find where the edge of this parking lot is here. Looks like right about there. We should be hitting it. Why are you skipping so much snow now? See if when we zoom out the ways if we can see where this road goes. Yep, we're like right on the edge of it, so we'll turn here and clean this up. 
or off, whatever you want to call it. Did not uh, get that grass pile texture changed. That's kind of awkward that it's just a big green thing <laughs> stick it out of the snow. Okay, we should be nearing the edge of this. Fairly soon, I think. There we go. There's the edge. Oops, I need to go on this side, not that side. wants to uh, clip on the parking lot. Parking lot must be a lot higher. Now it's plowing pretty good, full speed. Let's clear out this parking lot here. Would have been nice if he had put uh, Petrol J if he had put some cars in the parking lot here, you know, to kind of give it a little bit of realism. But unfortunately, he did not. Really? Parking lot goes farther. There we go. That's the edge of it. something there. I don't know what that was. Must have been a shift in the parking lot or something. Just rolling right on through this snow here.
kind of try and straighten this out a little bit. That's not going to work. <laughs> not going to work at all. Holy smokes. That was crazy. Okay, we cannot leave one little spot of snow left. Just like that, that just, that does not make sense. That would drive me nuts. Just sit and look at it. Yep, GPS does not like fast things that articulate. <laughs> or does not like things that articulate when they drive fast. Yeah, we'll just kind of try and get as much snow plowed as we possibly can. Uh, we're not going to clean out too many areas, like in town. We'll just kind of clean out, uh, we'll clean out the farms, you know, every farm, kind of. And then, um, we'll clean out, like, the dealership, and then the gas stations, and the elevators. And then, that's kind of about it. And then just kind of the main highways and you know, the roads in town, they sit above the ground a ways, so the snow isn't on top of them. Um, it kind of sits underneath of it. You know, you can see it, but you can't do anything with it, which kind of sucks. I mean, it you you can tell it's there. It's not like not like it's sitting above the ground or anything though so we'll push this little bit of snow in really we probably only needed to plow just a little bit of this like up near the building more but really what in the world was that what kind of crap is that That's ridiculous. We're supposed to push forward. Oh. That's why. It helped to have this thing all the way on the ground. My bad. Here I was blaming it on the bo box plow. Oops. Okay, I think that's enough snow down here, and then if we just go up here and push some snow. Yeah, because they can get down here, and then they can get up here. and So we'll move a little of this snow, maybe right here, over, something. try and stay as straight as possible so we'll just clear out this bit of snow and then we'll clear away out of here and go back to town let's push this a little bit off the road here.
beacons are off. Must have turned. Oh yeah, they turned off when we got out to find where the road was. I guess if the airport needs more room cleared, they can call us and we can come back. Come back and clear more snow for them. Definitely does not take long to move a lot of snow with this thing. Would not mind having one of these in real life to move snow with. That's for sure. Of course, in real life, though, you gotta push the snow someplace into a pile. And your thing fills up after a while, but still, it'd still be nice. Especially with a payloader. Just drive nice and fast. Come on, auto save. Uh oh. It's taking a lot longer to save than normal. Why is that? This is not good. Oh, there it goes. Whoa. Okay, there we go. I don't know why that took so much longer to save there. Sometimes it does that. And I still have never figured out why. They should definitely not need more uh, space than this. Don't think many people are going places much during the winter time. But with Christmas coming up, they'll definitely need their uh, airport cleared. For people that are coming in, people that are going out. All that good stuff. Plane there.
I'm just gonna tab out here and see uh, what we're doing for time. Another four minutes. So I think what we'll do is we'll um, we'll finish clearing this off, and then clear our way back to town, and then uh, we'll continue from there in the next video. Got yeah, one more pass, and then we're out of here. They can handle where their planes are at. That's not not our problem. This really isn't our problem, but we uh, we are out clearing snow anyways, so we can clear this stuff off. Oh, that would be why we're not driving very fast. Or steering very well. But we'll definitely come back with the uh, skid steer and we'll clear that all off up there. Okay, now we'll just book it on down to this end and then we'll head out of here Again with missing snow. What the world? Not sure why. Oh well. We're getting enough snow cleared off. If they got to drive through a little pile of it, then it's no big deal. If it's a big deal, they can find a way around it. Try, drive, try driving a little slower or something. And we got the bucket on too, so it should plow just fine. It was. Ooh, now we got the thing way too far down. Maybe I shouldn't have even turned it off. Let's just see what happens here. Yep, that's going to end horribly. <laughs> What's going on here? Ah, we're a little too far down, I see. Oh, oh, we're too far. Tilted forward. There we go. Now we should be fine. just get to town here. Darn blade would cooperate. And road. 
world. I don't even think we're dragging on the ground, really. As much as we should be. Ah, uh, we'll leave that piece of snow. Come on, Blade. There we go, now we're just above the ground. So we should be fine. Yeah, definitely uh, would have totaled this payloader and both the buckets had we still had the damage mod in. That would not have been fun. So yeah, we'll just clear our way uh, back to town and then... And then uh, in tomorrow's video, we will clear out some farmyards. We'll get the tractor and skid steer loaded up on the PJ, and then we will, well, after we clear our yard first, but then uh, we'll get some yards cleaned and we'll get that done. course here. I'd like to stay so that way we can see the white line for most of this road. That would definitely be helpful. <clears throat> so we'll clear that side of the road, or that little um, off the little turn piece there, that will clear off with the snowblower and skid steer, I think. And or skid steer, I guess I should say. cab plowing here. It's definitely a lot harder to stop this thing going 27 miles an hour, or 26 miles an hour, I mean. So I guess, actually I'm going to put a thing uh, up in the top right corner of the screen here. Uh, I'm pointing at the top right corner of my screen. Uh, there will be a little card up there. Um, so you guys let me know if... Um, ah, never mind. Never mind, actually. No, I'm not going to do that. Never mind. <laughs> Alrighty guys, so that is going to do it for this video. If you enjoy the video, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to the channel, welcome to the channel. Make sure to subscribe if you like what you see. Um, make sure to turn on the post notifications to be notified every time I upload a new video. Be sure to check out down below in the description for my PC specs, my upload schedule, as well as other cool, as well as links to all my social medias, my mod site and other cool YouTube channels that are worth taking a look at. Thanks for watching, you guys. Have a very Merry Christmas, and we will see you tomorrow.